A debuting team in the Spikers turf is proving that they deserve the top spot in the Open Conference. And to tell us more about the Emu Spikers, we have with us Ish Polvorosa, Josh Villanueva, and of course, Coach Sami Akailar. Gentlemen, good evening and thank you for coming tonight. Good evening. Good evening, guys. <laughs> Alright guys, unang una, 2 and 0. What a start for all of you. Coach, I want to ask you first because I know it's hard to eh. <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, una ako. So, Coach, 2-0 and start. Did you ka ba sa results so far? Because again, 2-0 is a very strong start, top of the table. Kayo. Can you tell us a bit about your expectations? Mo sa Actually, we don't expect that we can win the two games because we have so many struggles in training and putting some players, new players in our team. So, since all of them are good, all of them are coming from the other university, so I just lang na mix mix. Then it so happened we won the game. All right, I mean two and O and the banggit ni coach may challenges. Parang wala naman. So <laughs> Ish, tell us, ano ba yung challenges na yan na kaharapan niyo ngayon? But what is I guess the silver lining in everything? Well, basically, as you guys said, no, we are, we are a debuting team. Uh, this uh, conference for the Spikers there. We uh, just formed this team in PNV of Champions League last yeah. year, mm -hmm. and m almost half of the team. Nung time na yon, wala na sa original team. So, so totally, ang daming bagong players sa team. So, although on paper, malalakas naman yung mga pumalit yeah. ngayon. Sila Josh, sila Kim Malabunga, and, yeah. and Luis Ramirez. Siyempre, the chemistry and the gelling kailangan pa rin uh, i-practice. Eh. Yun din yung uh, pinaperfect pa rin namin sa ngayon. Josh, can you explain yung chemistry na yon? Because trying to gel together in such a short amount of time, tapos ang daming pang bagong, bagong faces, how does the team come together to make sure that, okay, kailangan maayos tayo going to the Spikers turf? Uh, siguro yung chemistry na yun, uh, well, kasi yung basics na general dapat eh, di ba? Kasi sabi-sabi ni Coach Sammy, galing kami sa mga different universities na, like, may mga napatunayan naman din kami individually, and since it's, uh, I mean, professional volleyball na to eh, so, when we come to the team, dapat, uh, prepared kami, mm -hmm. and, uh, kung baga, ano na lang talaga siya eh, parang, what you can bring sa table, to right. the table, yeah. Coach Sammy, earlier you mentioned challenges and of course changes in the team because iba nga yung last year sa ngayon. Um, siguro, Coach, you mentioned earlier also there are no expectations. So what has been the goal and how did that translate to 2 and 0 ka agad? Well, actually, during our training, uh, as a coach, I do my job. As the players, of, of course, they do their job. So what, what I did is, uh, to mix all the basic fu basic fundamentals of volleyball, of course, the blocking, the, the receive. So, pinaghalo-halo ko sila. And at the same time, pinag-aaralan ko ngayon talaga yung kanilang expertise sa bawat isa para to put up a good team. Mm -hmm. And of course, uh, Josh Kurtzami, itong si Ish kasi analyst siya dito eh. Normally, <laughs> alright? So, he's normally, he's normally here anyway. So, I wanna ask you to analyze yourself muna. Because yeah. ito, 14 excellent sets in the game against Air Force, straight set win, then following up with 30 excellent sets going into that game against Santa Rosa. What do you see in your teammates and in, in what in what's happening on the floor? Because those are great numbers and of course, to no start early on, setters are very important in that, in that role. I'm going to analyze it. Anyway, uh, I think it just helps, na, greatly helps actually, na I have two very good liberos mm -hmm. and then I have uh, Hiro Ostre and Luis Ramirez, they're passing hitters. So, dun, sa part na yun, hindi ako nahihirapan sa mm -hmm. first ball reception. So, na, nakapagbigay ako ng place sa mga spikers ko na very capable of scoring points for the team. And dun sa part na yun, talagang uh, sa connection pa lang yung sabi ng coach sa basic fundamentals of volleyball, hindi na ako nahihirapan as a setter. So, yun talaga yung pinaka-importante. Siguro, that's why the result is like that. How unbiased! Oh, wow! <laughs> Galing, it's a team no? effort, though. No? Yes. <laughs> team effort. I love it. Josh, tell us about what kind of preparations you're making. Alam ko, and daming inya challenges and changes, mm -hmm. and as you go through the conference, a lot of new things are also coming in for your next game against Signal. Yeah. Um, what's the focus there? What's the goal? Well, uh, definitely tomorrow's a big game, talaga. Yeah. Kami, well, prepare lang kami mentally, siguro. And um, kabi ng coach namin, yung ibalik yung condition ng katawan namin, kasi like some of us, may mga kanya-kanya kami mga work, ganyan. Mm -hmm. And hindi lang ito yung ginagawa namin. Eh. So parang kailangan talaga mabalik lang yung condition ng katawan. Mm -hmm. And kung sa mental preparedness, I mean preparation, uh, siguro yun lang talaga. Kasi, you know, magkakilala na exactly. sa korte. Eh. Yeah. Former teammates. Yeah, former teammates, diba? Diba sila Mark. Yeah. 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 So, 
Coach Sam, Coach Sammy, <laughs> can you tell us a bit about yung challenge mo? Because I, it must be enjoyable knowing that okay, and daming mong pieces that you can move around, that you can mix and match, and everyone's coming from their own situations, either students or working wor- uh, working players. How's uh, that challenge na yun? Well, I have to adjust myself during training because, as, as you said, may mga work sila eh. So, in-adjust ko na lang yung sarili ko. For example, wala yung kailangan ko. For example, today, I have to focus on 12 players. So, hindi dumating yung 12 players eh. Only 8 players. Kung ano yung mga expertise nila, doon ko na sila kinitrain. And katulad the other day, kinitrain ko sa defense or blocking or situation we're in, yun ang gagawin namin during game. All right, so right now we have one last question. So we're going to save it for Ish. Because, you know, <laughs> not, not picking on him, but yes, I am. Uh, Ish, great start. How do you sustain it? Yung consistency na yun? We've seen from time to time, teams in the past, sometimes start out strong, but then falter. How can you avoid that? Um, I think we can avoid that by preparing properly. And I think we started really from the bottom. Because sobrang ikli lang talaga ng preparation namin. And there are some additions at the very last minute and there will be an addition oh, later juicy. on in the conference. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, we're expecting um, a lot from the team pero syempre, hindi naman kami mag-expect kung hindi namin paghahandaan ng maayos yung conference. Wow. Ish knows how to make drama. <laughs> okay. oh, yes. <laughs> drama talaga. Okay, drama guys. Maraming yeah. salamat. A great start at the conference. You. Good luck for the rest of the conference and hopefully we can have you back here again soon. Maraming salamat. <laughs>